Just follow my instructions, and the Dark Brotherhood will be back on top. All thanks to you, listener. <laughs> yeah. Kill well. Yeah, and all often. thanks to me. Let's check what this root looks like. Got taproot, got nern root, got jaren root. Oh, man. Wow. Look at it. It does look gnarly. What else looks like this? There's something else that looks just like this, huh? This is just like a palette swap or whatever, huh? Can I eat it? Oh, I ate it! Am I gonna- No! Oh, shit! <laughs> I mean, look! How many times have we done this? And it's like, oh, you can't eat a quest. I was like, haha, yeah. I read I can't eat it. <laughs> hey, I'm fine. Okay, whoa. Astrid, we gotta go back Brother. and get see. We gotta go to Stress Mackay and get some more Jared Root. When we had last left the last dragonborn, they carried out the penultimate part of the plan to assassinate the Emperor of Tamriel. This time it involved learning the true hidden identity of the gourmet, the famed super chef from across Skyrim land to Bretonia to high, to high Rock to everywhere imaginable. What amazing feasts and tastes had they created for the peoples of the land to enjoy. Now they found their true form and traveled out to the cold inn and killed them and it was there that they disposed of their body inside of a lake <laughs> and as we all know there is no greater insult to a chef than to kill them and put their body in a lake <laughs> now it was time to speak with Astrid for the final task was upon them yes it was time to kill the Emperor. This is the Elder Scrolls V Skyrim. Welcome back. Zoop. There we go. And I'm feeling pretty good. I'm feeling pretty good. I'm feeling pretty, uh, you know, all systems nominal. Feeling, feeling like all systems are nominal right about now. Feeling like we're back, uh, we're pretty much back to normal. Maybe got a few sniffle here and there, or a stuffed up nose or something, but otherwise... <laughs> I'm feeling like we're... Oh, we're right as rain! Let's head on over here and speak with Astrid now. There we are, and before we forget... Just after speaking to her, we Shadow definitely need to resummon all but forgotten. Lucy. Death, my friend. From another time. Okay, up here. Astrid, hey. So it's done. You've killed the gourmet. And now, Titus Mead II is as good as dead. So, it's time. We're ready to assassinate the Emperor. Oh, yes. And I've decided you will have the honor. Well, I won't disappoint you, Astrid, or the Dark Brotherhood. The Emperor will die, for Sithis and the Night Mother remain silent. We're just stewing in anger, like, what else? What have you all really done? Vizar is like the only one who even remotely helped out and showed up when I was getting messed up. And frankly, maybe Vizara would have showed up even more if not for the fact that we got kind of <laughs> attacked and Vizara was mortally wounded in the process. I mean, Astrid, your own husband went missing and <laughs> and I went out to look for him, right? How does that look on you? Frankly, I know Arm Garm Garm is kind of like a doofus, but I would be a little upset if you didn't even show up, right? Like, it's not exactly like Astrid, you're defenseless or whatever. You're like a trained killer. You're one of the best. Or so I've heard. And you just decided, like, eh, I guess I'll just let this other dude do it. Watch yourself out <laughs> oh, there. Oh, fuck. All right, sorry. Sorry, Astrid. I was too busy, like, roasting you. And okay. now, Titus Mead the Let's see. Yep. Yeah. Oh, yes. Uh, yeah, and the Emperor will die for Sithis and the Night Mother. Yes, for Sithis and the Night Mother. You are the listener, after all, hmm? Mm. So let's not waste any more time. Okay. Go now to Castle Dower in Solitude. 
present the gourmet's writ of passage to the officer in charge, Commander Marrow. I'm sure you remember him. You'll gain unrestricted access to the kitchens, and then the Emperor. You're posing as a chef, so you'll be able to poison his meal rather easily. Okay, yeah, I'm a really well-armed, powerful-looking chef. Thankfully, none of them also know that I'm the Dragonborn, right? They do acknowledge the Dragonborn, like, main story quests and stuff here and there throughout the Dark Brotherhood. But it does make it kind of problematic when, when you roll up there, like, oh, yeah, I am the gourmet. <laughs> uh, okay, which, which poison I should use? Which poison I should use? <laughs> okay, yeah. Which poison I should use? Here, take this. It's called Jaren Root. Oh, All it okay. takes is one taste, and the effects are quite immediate. The Emperor will be serving is this like a callback? before he even knows he's dead. To Once a past Mead game I'm killed, unfamiliar with. Escape through the upper door and across the bridge. I've arranged for it to be unguarded once the alarm is sounded. Now go, my friend. Go and fulfill your destiny as listener. People who have played, like, Daggerfall or Arena or, like, Battlespire or something, they're like, Oh my god, Jaren Root? Whoa! <laughs> Chef's kiss. All right, what else can you tell me can you tell me about Jaren root? It's a rare plant found only on the island of Stros Mackay. Oh, old Stros Mackay. Like any vegetable, cut up, put in a salad, perhaps boiled in a stew. One taste will lead to nearly instant death. So don't even think about it. Okay. Sure, why didn't we why don't we just put poison in it though? <laughs> right? Like if it's a stew, like, if we make them a stew or whatever, it's not exactly like, oh, whoa, you put a razor in here or whatever. Like, like most things will blend in with a stew, right? Okay, anything else before I set off? It took all the favors, bribes, and blackmails I could muster, but I've secured your exit out of the keep. Just follow my instructions, and the Dark Brotherhood will be back on top. All thanks to you listener <laughs> kill yeah. well and yeah. often all thanks to me let's check what this root looks like got tap root got nern root got jaren root oh man wow look at it it does look gnarly what else looks like this there's something else that looks just like this huh this is just like a palette swap or whatever huh can i eat it oh i ate it Am I gonna- No! Oh, shit! <laughs> I didn't look! How many times have we done this? And it's like, oh, you can't eat a quest. And I was like, haha, yeah. I read I can't eat it. <laughs> hey, I'm fine. Okay. Whew. Brother. Astrid, we gotta go back and get some- We gotta go to Stress Mackay and get some more Jaren Root. I ate-, <laughs> I ate it! Brother. Oh, uh, shit. <laughs> Wait, what do you do? <laughs> Hang on, should we try and complete the quest without the Jaren root? Can we do it without the Jaren root? Do I need the Jaren? <laughs> yeah, I can assassinate him using any tools available. Until next it's time, fine. brother. It's fine. It's fine. Look, we have canonically eaten the Jaren root. Look. I really needed to know that first reagent, right? So that way, by the time Elder Scrolls 6 rolls around, or 7, or whatever the fuck, and it's rumored that the Dragonborn has gone to Stress Mackay, our character will know all about that first uh, re er, ingredient something? property. <laughs> I can't believe it. How many times have we had, like, a food... Or even like a reagent just like that, where we try to eat it, and it's like, you can't eat a quest item. Come on. Come on. Take it easy. All right? Relax. Don't eat this. All right? You're going to need it. Now it's just like, fuck it. <laughs> this one even kills you. <laughs> okay, bizarre. Greetings, brother. Hey, any advice on my current contract? Astrid has arranged for your escape, no? Then you have nothing to worry about. Get in. Kill the Emperor and get out. Then we celebrate. Okay, I don't like that you've brought this up now, too. This 
<laughs> this is making me think that it's going to really go sideways right whenever we try to escape. I don't even remember exactly how it goes, other than like it's way more, I don't know, dour. Hello, Tidbit. Hey, any advice on my current contract? You get to kill the Emperor. The bloody Emperor. You'd better enjoy this one. You owe us all that much. So make it bloody, painful, and spectacular. Arnbjorn, are you even allowed to say bloody with this kind of, a, like, an American accent? Until next time, brother. Okay. Hey. In the Dark Brotherhood, I found acceptance, love, and my life's true purpose. Sit this whisper be upon you, brother. Any advice on my current contract? What an honor. The assassination of an emperor. And all because you are the listener, favored by the Night Mother, anointed by Sithis. I'm so very happy for you, if not a bit envious. Okay, well, I didn't decide this. I would be willing to have everybody come with me and we all, like, stab them at one time. Hey, Babette. It's been quite a boon. Look, uh, let's some buy some junk. weird me, shit as well. I call them treasures. There we go. Good. And let's also pawn off some of this. There we go. Good. Okay. Hey, any advice on this contract? Don't take any chances with this one. Use the giant root to poison the Emperor's food. You're disguising yourself as a chef. It only makes sense. Yeah, yeah, I'll use the jarring root. Yeah. Until next time, brother. Wait, could we have planted the jarring root and grown more? Oh, good to see no. you, brother. Gearing up to kill the Emperor. <laughs> Exciting times. Exciting times indeed. Yeah, I'm gearing up. I'm over here brushing Death the dirt the off of my jar and root, you know. In the void. Oh, any good <laughs> any advice you, on my brother. current contract? Well, while it's true, I prefer sorceries more destructive nuances. We mustn't forget the many spells with simpler, more practical applications. Sure, you can poison Isn't that also emperor, destruction? But then, why not summon an Atronach to cause some chaos? Or turn invisible and slip away. Use your imagination. Right, but these aren't the simple ones, right? I feel like I feel like throwing a fireball is one of the more simpler ones. Okay. Sure. Kill well and often. Festus, are did you even go to the College of Winterhold? <laughs> I'm the Archmage, you know. <laughs> okay, hey, Nazir. Brother. Any advice on my current contract? Yes. You're killing the Emperor himself. The Dark Brotherhood will get one shot at this, and you've been given the honors. So don't screw up. Okay, sure. Happy hunting. I wonder if they'll try to top this again with the Dark Brotherhood arc in Elder Scrolls VI. Assuming there is one. If there isn't a Dark Brotherhood arc, like, there'll probably be an equivalent. You know, just like how the College of Winterhold is, you know... It's not the Mage's Guild formally, but, you know, it's it's a magic-based quest arc, you know? I would have to imagine that there will at least be a rough equivalent, right? But I wonder if they'll try to top killing the Emperor. I don't even know how else you can get without, like, teetering on main quest territory, right? Like, killing a, a Daedric Prince or killing, like, an Aedra or something somehow. Like, I don't even, like, what, how do you raise the stakes on that without it getting too high of stakes where it's like, oh, th why isn't this just the main quest, you know? Because already this in and of itself, you know, the stakes on this. Killing the Emperor, maybe it, yeah, maybe, maybe you just say fuck it, right? Because this does feel very high stakes, right? This, this could pass off almost as like a main Read quest it, in a sense. Brother. If you just retool Kill around well, the, the writing often. to make it less sinister and more like, yeah, the Emperor is so fucked up, we need to stop him, right? Which, like like I said before, who knows, maybe that'll end up being the storyline for um, the main quest in a future game, right? Brother, okay, Arnbjorn, nope, I already talked to you. Right I then. think we got everybody, right? Yeah, I think so. Brother, Anything else, Astrid? No. Until next time, brother. Okay. Well, let's head on up to Solitude. Oh, almost forgot. Fortunately, there's like all this loosened juice just around here. Uh, we may have to summon him on our way. Because he is totally not available now. Okay. 
Let's see here. Let's call for Odaving, right? There we are. Odaving! Good. And then let's get Bend Will ready here. Pop a quick save as well. Definitely hear Odaving on the way. I guess we can wait two hours safely then. Okay. There you are. Perfect. Got it in one. Oh my gosh. Beautiful. How can I serve you, Thori? Good. And then let's fly on off over to Solitude, right? There we are. Castle Dower, I think we gotta go to. Good. And then over here, we'll see if enough time has passed for us to resummon Lucian. Ooh, shoot. Okay, don't go that far. Yes, three. Wagolt. I will land at once. Eh, okay. I'll take it. There we are. I guess worst case, if we can't summon Lucian back up over here, we can always, like, run over to... Oh, yeah, here we go. I was about to say we could always go over to, like, the inn or something. Or even travel all the way out to Proud Spire. Okay. There we are. Good. Maybe Lucin has something to say right now? About killing the Emperor? No. Let's see. Should we also juice up our weapon? I think so. There we are. Cool. Okay. And then... What time of day is it? It's 2.13 p.m. I think that's plenty of time. We don't even need... We, we Yeah, we shouldn't need to rest or whatever. If we get a little bit tired during this quest, it's fine, right? Because, hey, this may even make it to where we kind of do this under the cover of darkness. Which, although I don't think is necessary, it's kind of like thematically appropriate. There we are. I can't believe, though, what is interesting about this absolutely zero mention of General Tullius, right? Am I- am I right in that? We've had, like, a lot of run-ins with, like, the Penitus Oculatus and all that junk. Hey, wanna play tag? I was always partial to apples myself. Uh. <laughs> but, uh, nobody mentions General Tullius at all. I don't think in the Dark Brotherhood quest arc. It makes me- wonder if maybe oh, hey. Legion, and you know what my time lazy and useless well. a lot of them. they can't even keep the storm the, the divine saved me from the streets the and they can save you from your trials as well shut up Solana. the emperor has never been safer you think assassination attempts are planned overnight we discovered the plot end of threat <laughs> do you but think they're the planned man? overnight Some okay killed, family name ruined and he acts as if nothing even happened. Think he's even fit for duty? Yeah. I'm going to pretend ah, yes. I didn't hear that. You're right. Solitude. The best the Penitus Oculatus has ever heard. No, it's so weird that so many people are, like, having faith in him. It's such a security risk. But to carry so a weight like that, very it's got to take its toll. That happened to me. I'd be a wreck. Yeah, yeah. That's wild. Okay. Hey, what else? Move along, Anything citizen. else? Move along, citizen. Yeah. The okay. Emperor's cousin killed right here in solitude. I feel nothing but shame. Uh. <laughs> Did that dude just run up just to tell me this? What prey awaits us? Hey, Captain. Good to have you by my side, friend. I need oh. reliable people around. Yeah, sure. I don't know what I did, but sure. Okay. I wonder why we didn't just dress up as one of the Penitus Oculatus dudes, you know? Because we have their equipment now. They seem to be able to come and go as they please. There is murder in the Stop right there. The tower is off limits until further notice. Well, check it out. I'm actually the gourmet. What's this now? Uh, order of his eminence, possessor of these papers. The gourmet. By Azra. The gourmet. Azra. I, I'm sorry, I didn't realize. Wow, we I should no kill you right now for expect. Azra. You understand. You're not dressed as I would have suspected. 
but please don't let me keep you. Proceed yeah, to the my kitchen cover. straight away. Gianna, the castle chef, has been eagerly awaiting your arrival. My blade yeah, maybe he knows all of his yours. underlings. Maybe that's it. I, I'd believe that. That's that's a maybe a bit of a weird, but it's a suitable enough explanation for me. Okay, Castle Dower, Emperor's Tower. Oh. Okay. Oh, wow. All right. Sure. How about over here? Hey, Gianna, it's me, the gourmet. What Not do you want? Delivery. I told you people our stocks are fine. Now put whatever you have over there, then get out. Wow, Gianna, you're about to be feeling real dumb in a second. Not another delivery. I told you people our stocks are fine. Now put whatever you have over there, then get out. Who wrote this? Whoever wrote some of these things, they were having a little extra fun. Okay. You misunderstand. For I am the gourmet. The gourmet? Yeah. Oh, finally. <laughs> when I heard the gourmet was being brought in to cook for the emperor, I could hardly believe it. It's just... Yes? Silence! I am ready to prepare the grand feast! <laughs> Let's be a dick. Silence, Gianna! I'm ready to prepare the grand feast! Oh, well, uh, actually, you're not. Wearing a chef's hat, I mean. There's one right over there on the shelf. You can't very well cook without it. What? Why can't I wear- why, why can't I do it without a- what? Huh? Is there a little rat inside of it or something? Okay. On we'll what begin table? as soon as you're wearing the hat. Oh. Check the shelf over there. Wouldn't want the Emperor mistaking you for someone else now, would we? What? This is very odd. <laughs> I have to wear the hat? This almost makes it sound like Gianna is like a counter assassin and knows that I'm Dark Brotherhood. And she's put like a time bomb inside of the hat. And she's just like, yeah, of course you gotta wear the hat. <laughs> and her, her palms are like sweating. She's like, God, have him pick up the hat. This is the imposter. <laughs> okay. Sure. Chef's hat. Great. Love it. <laughs> yeah. I sure do look like, uh, yeah, he's, he's definitely gonna know I'm, a, I'm cooking big time. Oh, look at the back of my head. <laughs> There's so much... Why is there so much extra real estate at the back of this hat? <laughs> this is like a very ill-fitting hat. Goodness. Okay. Sure. D oh, Gianna, does your hat fit you. really poorly? Absolutely brilliant. Now, now you're just as I imagined. Really? Okay. Yeah, so hers... She has hair there, but I guess because of my oh, mohawk, it doesn't really you. work out. Absolutely brilliant. Now, now you're just as I imagined. Enough! The gourmet is here to cook, not talk. Let us begin. Oh, yes, but of course. <clears throat> the Emperor has requested your <laughs> signature dish, the potage le magnifique. I've taken the liberty of getting it started. But the cookbook only says so much, and everyone makes the potage differently. I would be honored if we could make it the gourmet's special way. The base broth is already boiled. We can get started right now. So, uh... Which ingredient should I add next? <laughs> you can remain silent. <gasps> See, the remain silent thing is so weird now because you are forced to say some other stuff, right? Like, just now we had to talk, right? I believe in Oblivion, you can make it through the entire thing without ever being forced to actually speak. But here it's, it's just, it's so bizarre. It's like such an odd wink and nod to how Oblivion did it, right? All right, yeah, remain silent. Oh, I get it. This is a test, right? You want to see how well I know the potage le magnifique. Well, then, I think a pinch of frost salts should do the trick, right? Frost salts? Now what? <laughs> sure, yeah, this is my dark secret. Yeah, the next ingredient is... Vampire dust. Vampire dust? Seriously? Hmm. Yeah, that's guess right. I, guess I can see how that would add a more earthy texture. And oddly enough, we do have some on hand. All right. How do you know what vampire time. dust tastes like? Wait, how do you know that? Are you are you weird like me? Are you just eating weird shit? Gianna, do you eat weird shit too? 
Oh my god. <laughs> we shall now add a giant's toe. One nern root. Wait, if you add the nern root to the soup, the nern root stops making noise once you pluck it, right? How long does it take for the nern root to stop making noise? Is it possible for you to, like, pluck a nern root and have it still be, like, screaming a bit and then cook with it? I wonder. Really? Oh, I use nin root as a special seasoning all the nin time. Root. What a wonderful idea. Okay, now what? Gianna, you're fired. Add a fucking septum. <laughs> add, a se add a septim, I should say. A septum? As in a gold coin? Really? Ah, I see now. That would give the potage le magnifique a slightly metallic but delicious aftertaste. Ha, <laughs> simply brilliant. I have to say, the stew seems done. Add anything else and we may dilute the distinct flavors. So, uh, is that it? Ninrut. Now it all makes sense. Of course she's eating weird shit. She's an idiot. <laughs> she, <laughs> she is like me. <laughs> We're done. Let us serve the potage la magnifique. Excellent. They should be ready for us now. And if I may say so, it has been an honor getting a chance to prepare a meal with, well, the best chef in the entire empire. I'll carry the stew pot and lead the way up to the dining room. I'm sure the Emperor and his guests are dying to meet you. Ah, ho, 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 ho. <gasps> okay. Well, let's take some of these then. Look, just in case they want us to make a few more. There we are. Oh, Charis eggs, okay. Uncommon taste. Some wine. What else you got under here? Potatoes, garlics. Okay. You know what? what is odd? One of the things that it allowed us to say that we should add is not here. Amazingly, I don't see a sweet roll. That was one of the first things that we could have said, like, yeah, put in a sweet roll. <laughs> put, put in a fucking sweet roll. There's not a sweet roll here. What the fuck is going on at Castle Tower? <laughs> they got frost salts, giant's toes, money, vampire dust. There's not a sweet roll. <laughs> this must be like one of the few civilian coded like interior locations that doesn't have a sweet roll. <laughs> it's nowhere here. It's not even like around the corner or anything. What? If I did say sweet roll, would she have been like, oh, I'm sorry, we don't have one. <laughs> Good lord. That's so weird. Okay. Sure. Yeah, what's back here? Got salt back here? Oh, yeah. I'm assuming she added salt, right? As is necessary with, like, literally every single food item in all of Skyrim. Okay. There we go. Except that, uh, I guess, if you're cooking, like, like, grilling leeks, that didn't take salt. Or if you use, like, fire salts, that also, well, those kind of count as salt. Right? Okay. Sure. Gianna, don't you think I, being the, you know, the gourmet and all, Maybe I should be the one carrying the food. What if you tip it over and spill our magnificent creation? Even more amazing is she didn't even taste any. Even the least bit nervous oh. After everything that's happened? You mean the wedding? My cousin's apparent murder? An unfortunate mistake. Chana, do you hear this really no weird more. creepy guy talking? Cold mead, hot tempers. Oh my god, that's the emperor! <laughs> Yet that Here we are. God's <gasps> the emperor has we'll creepy guy moment. voice. Please, I'll <laughs> you just stand there. I did not amazing. remember that. Yes. Oh, an unfortunate turn of events that, but an isolated incident, and I have been assured that the fault was with the man's son alone. Truth is, we are in no danger whatsoever. Killing an emperor can be useful, but befriending one, now that's beneficial, as I'm sure you'd all agree. Aha! Here we are, honored guests. 
I present to you the gourmet. Ah, the potage les I don't magnifique. remember this being how it so goes. Delicious. My friends, as emperor, I of course reserve the right of first taste. <laughs> oh. Oh, how Dude, are they playing us? Just delicious. It is everything I had hoped it would be. Please, oh. everyone, enjoy. Wow, it's just like the Luau in Stardew Valley. <laughs> cool. Okay. Dude, I don't think this is the Emperor. I don't remember exactly how this plays out, but... I don't think this is him, right? Was this meant to be a major fake-out? Keep it together, Gianna. Keep it together. Gianna, Maybe you're when fucking this is all losing over, it. You could sign one of your cookbooks for me? Let's see, what about you, Penitus Oculatus? Such an honor. The missus and I love your strawberry tarts. Oh. The gourmet. Leave it to Titus to spare no expense. Sean. The gourmet. Leave it to Titus to spare no expense. Mm. The potage le magnifique smells delicious. Charmed. I prefer a good roast duck. But your soup will do. Okay. I've been waiting for this opportunity for a long time. Dude, this ain't him, is it? This ain't him, right? So this isn't how you do you it. In Skyrim. Serving your emperor was worth the wait, of course. You're not at all what I expected. I imagined you'd be fatter, honestly. Wow. You've done your duty and we're all very grateful. Now, I'd like to eat. You've done your duty and we're Maybe all very grateful. Maybe you shouldn't eat. Now, I'd like to eat. Charmed. Man, how do I kill him? I guess I'll just feed him a I'm whole so bunch nervous. of apples. <laughs> You've done your Should duty I just and feed him a bunch of apples? Okay. Oh, here, let's... <laughs> let's do this, old chestnut, huh? Take his robes. Grateful. There we go. Now. Like <laughs> Look at this. Everybody like this? Y'all know what's going on here? Y'all read the, hear about this one before? Yeah, his robes are so beautiful, huh? <laughs> yeah, this is the real emperor. <laughs> okay, yeah. What, you expect me to believe this guy's the emperor? Yeah, look at me. Look, hey. <laughs> yeah, look. I'm about to be the fucking emperor too here as well. Yeah, look. I'm the fucking emperor. <laughs> I love soup. I love potage le magnifique. <laughs> I, mm, I definitely believe that you are the gourmet, and I'm definitely the emperor. Piece of shit, you naked old bastard. You've done what your duty, fuck? and we're all very grateful. I'm gonna force now, feed him apples as he thinks it's soup. Okay. Let's see. Oh shit, I don't have any more? Oh no, wait, okay. <laughs> Good. I like to eat. <laughs> By the gods, the gourmet has killed the emperor. Attack! Whoa! I'm gonna find him. Whoa, whoa, whoa! <laughs> okay. How did, what makes you think it was me? Come on, it works every other time. <laughs> Fuck. Okay, sure. Let's put this hat back on. Hey, what were you doing? Victory is yours. I submit. <laughs> Don't hurt ah, enough! Okay, good. Easily. Ah. This can't be how it goes, is it? Ah. This, like, this ain't it, right? Huh. I'm getting out of here. Okay, well. Mm, let's take all their salmon. <laughs> Lovely. <gasps> okay. Anything else? Hmm. Maybe we should take his body too. Someone do something. You know, should we? Should we? <laughs> hang on, can we do that? What's his power at? What's his power level? You know, what's his power level? Surely he's not. Uh, he's not too powerful for this. I mean, he died with a single apple. There we go. Good. Okay. Hey, he's back, baby! 
Hell yes. Okay. Cool. Oh, where'd he go? Hey, where'd he go to? <laughs> okay. <laughs> There's a naked Emperor Titus Mead II rolling around. Or is there? <laughs> okay, sure. Let's head on out here. Good. Oh, fuck. Damn. Yeah, no wonder my follower can't accompany me here. Okay. Escape the tower. Forgiven, and armor fuck, forgiven. yeah. How... How do I? <laughs> oh, dear. Okay. Well? Hmm. Is it because of Gordon? Is, is it because Gordon was there? Did Gordon, like, push me under the ground into, like, ultra stealth mode? I think it was. Armed I can hear armed. Gordon, like, going guy. around. Good lord, Gordon. What am I to do? Can I, like, can I re-enter uh, an interior from here? Okay. Yeah, maybe this will work. All right. There we are. Uh, hey! There we go. Cool. Wonderful. Look, and they're none the wiser. Hey. Move along, citizen. Sure. Escape the tower. Okay. How do I, how do I escape? I feel like I've already done it. Thanks, Gordon. Let's, let's, let's bring up our map and everything here. Where am I meant to go? Oh, over here? Okay. Sure. Is this... Is this it? I go out this way? Huh. Where's our marker at? Oh yeah, right here. Oh, hey everybody. Y'all see the gourmet? Jeez. Last Dragonborn here reporting for duty. I heard someone killed the Emperor. Oh, that wasn't actually the Emperor? Okay. Well, that's great. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Alright. Sure. Oh. That man was, by far, the most insufferable decoy the Emperor has ever employed. I'm glad he's dead. You're gonna slow clap you me after all that? You killed him. You. Assassin for the Dark Gordon, Brotherhood. I hope you push this Just man directly the into life. the fucking ground. Would have succeeded had it been the real man. Surprised? So was I when a member of your family came to me with a plan. We worked out a deal, you see. An exchange. I get you, and the Dark Brotherhood gets to continue. Oh, someone's a loyalist. But you know what? I've changed oh. my mind. How about this? I kill you and butcher each and every one of your miserable little friends. Your sanctuary is being put to the sword right now. That's what I think of this deal. You killed my son. All of you. And now you'll pay the price. Kill him. Make Wait, sure where there's is nothing he? left to bury. Did Gordon actually for real push him under? Yeah. <laughs> I forgot you had the invisible. Okay. Here, maybe we can Hasadoke him out? Can we hit him with the old Hasadoke? Yes, man! Oh fuck, the invisible wall. Okay. Go, has a doke! Come on! Oh, come on! Oh, how come it worked earlier? Listen to him yell. <laughs> Shit. Oh, man. Whoa. There we go. Okay, well. Someone died. Okay. Hang on, everybody. Just trying to get him through here real quick. Oh god. 
Hang on, Kosnick. Chill, Kosnick. Chill. Chill. Ooh. Corundum. Okay. Shit. Shot right through his head. Good lord. Okay. Remember, <laughs> okay. hit the one in the middle. Okay. Christ, man. Come on. <laughs> oh god. Everybody How did we do it? Around. How did we even well, do no it? More. Put up a real fight. Okay. Ah! There we go. This time for sure. Okay, this time for sure. Oh, he's absorbing it, of course. Ah! Oh hell! Okay. Okay, this time for sure. This is what Shit. I tried! Ah! Oh, bastard! Ah! Oh, I'm running out of juice here, man! Okay, here. Let's juice back up. There we go. Ah! Oh man. <laughs> he hit the bird. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Sorry, bird. I'll raise a cup to your brain. Oh, come on. Well, two out of three ain't bad. <laughs> okay. Where's where's Gaius Morrow, though? Gordon, did you actually eliminate him? I think Gordon maybe really did eliminate him. Because I didn't see the dude anywhere. Unless we, like, flung him off and he was actually one of them there. You have oh. committed crimes against Skyrim and her people. What say you in your defense? I didn't do it. It was the gourmet. <laughs> All right. But you just watch yourself. Oh, thank Next you. Next time I might not be so lenient. Okay, I appreciate it. You have committed crimes Whoa! against Skyrim and her people. What say you in your defense? I swear it was the it was, it was the gourmet. It was the gourmet. Come on. Uh Then pay with your blood. Oh, I'm gonna run. Okay. Wait, did he not care anymore? Oh no, wait, he definitely cares. Okay. Oh dear. So where's where's the bodies that we sent off of there? Ah! Where'd they go to? Was one of them actually Gaius Maro? Ah, I, I know we're being like shot at, but you know, this happens all the time. <laughs> I order the yard. Stop right there. Oh. Hey! Fuck off! All right. <laughs> just watch yourself. Next time I might not be so lenient. Thanks. Oh, time to cleanse ideas. the empire of its filth. What? Wait, what does that mean? Wait, why did you say that? Fight. Time to cleanse the empire of its filth. I order the yard. Stop right there. <laughs> uh, no. You have committed so crimes mean. against. Oh shit. <sighs> okay. Hey, did y'all see any, like, bodies go flying off of that ramp? I'm looking for some. I want to see if one is named Guy Samaro. <laughs> I don't see any of their bodies, actually, in truth. Hmm. Man, I just, like, jump dodged a whole bunch of arrows right there. That was pretty impressive. Alright, you know what? I'm just gonna steal some salmon right here. <laughs> uh, here we go. Appendidus Oculatus. And an amulet of Julianus. But that's it. Where'd the other body go? Was the other body Guy Smaro? Oh, God. Okay. Yeah, I don't see shit. Huh. Oh, no. Look at Rick. Wait, is Legit Ricka helping me? Do your no, she's... Okay. <laughs> Alright, we better get out of here. Hi! Ah, they'll never find me now! <laughs> okay. Cool. <laughs> Good. Oh man, there sure are a lot of red dots on the map, huh? Okay. And then... Sure, we have to return back to the sanctuary somehow, despite all of the chaos. 
So that explains why Gaius Morrow decided to go back, right? But even so, that's a lot of faith for them to put in, like, him having a wild-ass, uh, hunch, you know? Like, very easily they could have been like, dude, you're- you're clearly distressed thinking that there's some grand conspiracy at play here, you know? With the loss of your- your son, you're clearly, like, under duress. We need to- <laughs> you need to chill. <laughs> it could have just as easily gone that way as well. But that's- uh, it's suitable, I guess. I don't know. Someone down there wants me fucked up. Okay, if I go over this way... Jeez, Gordon, now I know how you feel. As a crab. Okay. Okay. Oh, Hoffingar guard. <laughs> Alright, hey, I need a ride out of here. Pedal to the metal. I can take you to any yeah. old capitals. I need a ride. Shit. Okay. Alright. How do we how do we survive this situation. <laughs> okay, we need a horse. We do need a horse. Right? Let's see. Oh, fuck. Oh, hell yeah. Okay. Look, this one ain't even running. You can't take that. Yeah, I can. Shut up. <laughs> All right. And then let's go over to... Oh, of course. Old Faithful. Winstead Manor. Perfect. Good, good, good. And then we can take our private luxury carriage out of here. Beautiful. Alright, let's do a quick save. Gaius Morrow didn't have, like, a important note or something on him, right? God, I bet he did. I bet he had, like, like a, a little journal or whatever, like Gaius Morrow's journal, like, My son has died, but I figured it out. Yes, the gourmet is about to be dead. And is actually a super assassin and the last dragonborn. It's time for me to get my revenge by also making a false emperor and having him get. Yeah, I'm going to have someone die. <laughs> yeah, right? You know, sure, I'm out here murdering people. That's pretty Whoa, bad, right? Pissed. But let's look at what the emperor just did. Let's look at what the Penitus Oculatum, uh, the Pen Peniter Panini did. Let's look at what they've just done. They killed this guy! Who was that emperor? Who was that old, like, creepy-voiced man? They killed an innocent, creepy-voiced man. You know? They set him up to die! What a nightmare! How horrible! Frankly, I should kill them for that! <laughs> right? Look, I'm the assassin. It, it's known. I, I'm doing horrible things. That comes with the territory. But you! <laughs> Come on! What is this? You're just signing innocent people to get killed by me? <laughs> How fucked up is that? <laughs> Alright. Fucking A. Let's go on over to our miraculous carriage. Hopefully it works as well. Is our bounty too high in solitude to ever peaceably return? <laughs> I don't know. Also... In line with that, uh, line of thinking there, with, uh, them using this random dude for their plot, they sure did figure out that it was the gourmet pretty quick. You know, I feel like they kind of just jumped to conclusions there. You know, it wasn't like they spotted me. The old fucking poison apple trick works every fucking time, baby! Works without a hitch every time! Except for the times where it doesn't work and you have to cast a frenzy spell on him and then it works. Right? But every fucking time it works. This time, fell over dead like, Oh shit, he died! It was the gourmet! <laughs> Come on! That's like something I would do! <laughs> right? You've got the subtlety of me! <laughs> Alright, fucking A. This fucking Peniter, Peniter, Penitus, Penitus, pen Penitus? Penitus. Pen yeah, penitent. Penitus. Pen <laughs> I'm saying it so many times it's becoming like a weird word. <laughs> I don't, I'm not enjoying it anymore. Alright. Good god. Let's see. So we may actually end up needing to like clear our bounty out in... Uh, what do you call it? Out in solitude. You know? 
Okay. And you know what? None of the other Brotherhood members showed up to help. What's up with that? Nobody was keeping tabs on me? Vizara would have. Vizara would have been there for me. Oh, Jesus. Is this wizard going to obliterate me? Going to oh, maybe. Yeah. Jesus, why is the ice so powerful, ah. dude? Oh my god. Ah. Oh, there we are. <sighs> Ooh, of winnowing. Eee. Okay, well, let's go on over here. And let's catch a ride on back to Falkreath, right? You would think that this would set our bounty to, like, maximum everywhere. <laughs> but I don't know. Maybe, shit, maybe it does. That'd be kind of cool, you know? It doesn't matter what Yarldom you're in. You're max bounty everywhere. Oh, good lord. We are so, like, freezing our keister off out here. I don't even remember where our carriage lord is. And it's so cold, I can't even see him either. Oh, there they are. Okay, good. Up. Hey. Need a ride? I can take you to any of the hold capital. Okay. Can you? I'm in combat. Need something? <laughs> what the fuck? <gasps> is like Cosnex still back at the city duking it out? Okay, let's go on inside. Maybe this will fix things. Oh, here we go. Look, this seems to have legit fixed things. Here, we can also rest a bit. That might help as well. And frankly, we could use it. Okay. There we go. Eight hours. Good. Wonderful. Kosnak is in here, but Vincent Van Gogh has seemingly, like, chilled. It's a good sign. Yeah, everything seems to be at peace. Okay. Where do you want Engar? To go? Perfect. All right. One ride down to Falkreath, baby. Climb and back, and we'll be off. There we are. Get up there. Good. Man, how do we find out? You how does it go from here him? now? Hmm. Yeah, I don't even remember how we get from this point to the other to to actually finding the emperor. Huh. Okay, well, it's going over this way. It is pretty fun, though, that it doesn't work out, right? But in a, in the same sense, it almost mirrors... not Well, not exactly mirroring, but in a way, it's similar to the Oblivion Dark Brotherhood, right? If we take it as, like, a rough template, where right at the end, it doesn't work out. You know, something goes wrong. Oh, what the fuck? Oh my gosh! It really is! It really is like Oblivion Land! It's the Panitis! Wow, these ones are really major babies. How did they know? Oh, because of the mole, right? The mole. That's it. Completed to kill an empire. Oh, look. Their shit's like ready to blow up. Hang on, can I like blow it up somehow? Can I do this with a torch? No? Okay. Well, it was worth it. <laughs> worth a shot. Uh, how about... Fireball! Yeah! Blow it all up! Your big carriage full of oil. No? Okay. Well, good one, Vincent Van Gogh. Alright. <laughs> Do you think every... All the way out here, they had to listen to some guy talking about, like... <laughs> Talking about Khajiits. <laughs> or they got whole countries of these in the south. <laughs> Good God. Alright, well. Take some of this. Cool. Yeah, it does very closely follow the... Oh, wow. The whole Oblivion setup. 
Okay. Yeah. Look at all these nasty barrels. Sure. Is it gonna be like all on fire in here? God, I hope so. Dunno. One of these corpses. Does it matter? Oh, oh yeah. Not. What's taking the others so long? The sooner we get out of here, the better. Smoke's getting bad. This place will be raging soon. It'll be raging. Arcturus <laughs> took some men deeper in. What's it to be sure? We should maybe assist them. <laughs> you assist all you like. And get roasted. These are like the trouble. dumbest guards in the I'll entire game, the huh? <laughs> the place is literally literally falling apart. They're just standing there chatting. <laughs> they like can barely breathe, right? They're coughing. They have torches out standing in a pool of, like, highly flammable oil or whatever it is. And it's oil that they brought here. They put it here and they're just standing in it, right? <laughs> okay. What was that? Time to yeah! Mercy! There we go. Ah! Good. Why is it shaking so much? There is a whole lot of shaking going on. Huh. Oh, there goes Vizara. Sheesh, just couldn't catch a break, huh? A bunch of chairs. Wait! He is a werewolf after all! Oh, shit! Look at you, man! You are a werewolf! Ah, oh, I didn't- I didn't think it was true! I didn't think it was true! Okay, I believe it now! Fuck, that's wild! Okay. There we go. Oh, damn. Okay. Is he dead? Dude, he's still alive in there. That was a little spooky. Ooh. Oh, shit, he- Oh shit! Yeah. Okay. I bet if we yeah. saved him, he would have said something. Probably something stupid. <laughs> Fuck him! <laughs> Alright. No way. Were they able to kill Babette? Were you all able to kill the vampire child? That would be wild. Can nobody do that? They got the wild mods installed. Okay. Should we take their weird robes and everything? I don't think we ever got any of them. Why not? If I am to die today, oh, we can save Nazir. The Dark Brotherhood. Okay. No one here now. Oh, they didn't kill Bobette because they can't. Because Bobette is the traitor. What the fuck? <gasps> so you are alive. I was starting to wonder. The Emperor. It was all a trap. Someone set us up. Considering most of us are now dead, I, I assumed as much. Or maybe it was Astrid. And before you ask, no, I don't think it was you. <coughs> well, maybe I did. But you saving my sorry hide just now sort of erased any doubts. <coughs> so, thanks. Okay, well, we... we should probably get out of here. You've got that right. Only a matter of time before we're... <coughs> roasted alive. Come on! Okay. Who else is in here, though? Nazir, who else is up in here? Listen. Oh. I am your only salvation. Come. Embrace me. Ooh. Yes! Okay! Shit! What about Nazir? Nazir, we gotta go get kinky with the Night Mother! Nazir, are you ready, man? Look, we're gonna have a three for baby! <laughs> Come on, Nazir, hop in, man! Damn it! There's got to be. <laughs> yeah! Look for a way out! <laughs> we are yeah, get in here, Nazir, get in here! There's room for three! No! This year, no! <laughs> oh, man. Oh, we get flushed down a fucking toilet? Jeez. 
shit. Okay. Yeah. Astrid and Bab Oh no, Naz Nazir and Babette. Going. It was Astrid. As fast as I can, you stupid she devil. I don't see you helping. I'm not exactly built for manual labor. Now come on, you've almost got it. Doesn't she have like vampire magic or something? One more telekinesis still exists. There. Can you get it open? I think so. Just hold on a moment. You must speak with Astrid. Here in the Dark Brotherhood Sanctuary. Okay. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Slow down. It's all right. You've been through a lot. Maybe you should just sit down for a bit. <laughs> he probably thinks it's weird that as soon as everything was crumbling around, I just decided to jump into the coffin with her. Because <laughs> frankly, that's what I <laughs> I would think the same thing. He's just like, fuck, everything's fucking up. It's burning. We're, we're going to die in here. Find a way out. And then he just sees me like immediately jump inside the coffin and start hugging the night mother's body. <laughs> He's just like, well, what the fuck? <laughs> I have to speak with Astrid. She's here in the sanctuary. Follow me. I'm fine, but the Night Mother has a another task for me. Let's go. I have to speak with Astrid. She's here? By Sithis, I thought we'd lost her. Let's go. Wait, who's the mole then? Dude, I bet it is Astrid. And that's why she didn't care about her husband. Wow, it all makes sense. She hated him the whole time. This is all an elaborate ploy for her to... Like, just break up with him. <laughs> okay, Babette. Nazir told me what happened in solitude. You poor dear. You've been through so much. Oh, thanks. Hey, Nazir, anything else? I'm with you, listener. How old would you say Nazir is? You know, because it, it's got me thinking now. What do you think the odds are of Babette and Nazir turning up in a future installment, huh? Huh. I could see it, right? I could see it. Nazir seems like I'm with you. Like middle aged, I would guess. Yeah, depending on how much time passes between games. Yeah, for sure. Alright, well, when next we come back, we're gonna go over there and meet in meet up with Astrid. How did they put out all the fire? How'd they do that? It just burn itself out? It sounded like everything got totally fucked up in a major way. Uh, Alright, well, until next time, please take care of each other.